All right, all right, all right, we're back. I want to show you the proper way to burnish or bed in your brake pads when you change your pads and rotors. Can you hear that? So this is a 2017 Kia Soul. They're pretty fun to drive. Every time I drive one of these, it's like wait for the hamster. Anyway, um, customer came in. Yeah, I gotta finish burnishing them. Customer came in, said that the brakes are squealing. You know, took off the front wheels and everything. And the front rotors were glazed. They were very, very shiny. And the pads were, you know, very, very, they had like no friction material because they were glazed. So the proper way to do that is the 30 30 30 rule. If you don't do this, you can't just put your rotors on because they had it at a, just had brakes done at another shop. They just slapped the rotors on. I don't even think they cleaned the oil off of them and just handed it back to the customer. Um, you can't just slap rotors on there, put pads on, and then go. You can't you will glaze the rotors you will not be able to stop it sometimes it's just you push on the brake and it feels like it just wants to keep going so the proper way to do it like I said 30 30 30 it's 30 miles an hour 30 stops and then you hold for 30 seconds let it cool down so that'll be like this let me see my speedo and you don't slam on the brakes you just gradually push. And then I sit for 30 seconds. And you do that 30 times, 30 miles an hour to a stop 30 times. And you sit for 30 seconds and let them cool down. And what that's doing is that's putting pad material on the rotor and it's kind of bedding everything in that way. You can actually stop the vehicle when you need to. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm coming across a lot of these cars lately where shops are just throwing parts on a car or not doing things properly. And it's actually a safety concern. Like going down the road and they just throw rotors and stuff on your car and they don't clean them off. And somebody pulls out in front of you and you got to slam on your brakes. Well, you're just going to keep going. Like, it doesn't make any sense to me, man. Like, I don't know. Maybe people need to take some training classes or something. But I'm going to do this for you one more time. Thirty miles an hour. Gradual push on the brakes. And you stop. And you hold. Thirty seconds. That's all it is. If you do this at home, use some brake cleaner, clean off your rotors, make sure everything, grease your slide pins. Actually, the slide pins weren't greased either. They just, the caliper was barely able to move around. So, you do brakes at home, you put your new rotors on, clean the oil off of them with some brake cleaner, wipe them down, you grease your slide pins and, and your hardware, whatever you need to do. And I put a coat of, you know, some, some anti disc brake quiet or sometimes there's some grease you can put on the back of the pad even though there's a shim there it's just a little bit of extra protection it gets rid of the brake squeal and then you just go 30 miles an hour to a stop 30 times and hold for 30 seconds that's all you gotta do and it's not hard braking just gradual braking so I hope you enjoyed your little brake 101 lesson anyway like comment share subscribe